Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Nathan. Just want to say uh, good morning, everyone, both the East and West Coast. If you guys are enjoying your day today here on Thursday, hope you guys are also looking forward to the weekend coming up. Start tomorrow on Friday. And for this video today of what I want to talk about is breaking news. Kirsten Storm is back to General Hospital as Maxi. So let's go right into it. The link will be in the description down below. This is from soapopertizers.com, posted on the 16th of June of 2016, posted today here on uh, Thursday of this week, and it says, Christian Storms, who began to, a temporary leave from the role of General Hospital's Maxi in May, and said back to Port Charles. A show rep confirms the popular star will return, this is a quote, this is what to say, will return to General Hospital and that viewers can expect to see her on see her on air the first week of August. Mom Brunette, ex Melanie of Days Are Lies, will be temporarily playing the role before Storms resumes taping. So, uh, happy, I'm happy for Christmas Storms. I'm back. I'm, excuse me, I'm glad she's back as a maxi, um, with General Hospital. And, um, you know, since she's going to come back to play the role of maxi, um, you know, a lot of people, and like it says before in my in the previous video, when I announced that Molly Burnett was temporarily replace, uh, replacing, uh, Christmas Storms as maxi, um, there were those that felt that, you know, uh, that, you know, it should be Christmas Storms who should be playing. Uh, Maxi reacting to Brie, William, uh, Brie Williamson's Claudette, and I agree with that uh, wholeheartedly. I would love to see those scenes uh, because I think that Crystal Storms can bring it. I think that she can bring that intensity, that fire, that passion of who Maxi truly is. Because you know, Maxi is a fashionista. You know, she is someone that does not back down. She is someone that is very, uh, you know, opinionated. Sometimes she brags and talks and acts too much here and there. But, you know, and she's trying to grow, grow up and learn from her mistakes and be a better person. And, you know, and from what's been going on right now to Maxie and Nathan, we all, we all know that their relationship has been tested due to what Nathan has told her about, you know, Claudette and what, um, how, you know, him and Claudette broke up when they were together and married due to, you know, uh, you know due to Nathan trying to help Claudette not leave the country but stay with him. For the time being, and uh, to me, I find it hypocritical though that Maxie's trying to to act like you know she's so squ uh, squeaky clean and everything else, like she hasn't done anything wrong, and that's the part that bugs me. And even what also bugged me as well was Spinelli, you know, played by uh, you know Bradford Anderson, you know, the other day when he was on um, General Hospital and you know he was in scenes with Ryan Pavey's uh, Nathan uh, Nathan uh, Nathan West, you know, Spinelli was you know, starting to sound so judgmental and everything else, like, he wasn't so innocent, like, he was, he's acting, excuse me, like, he's acting so innocent stuff, and to me, it's like, let Maxie and Nathan deal with their issues and their problems together, okay? Spinelli needs to stay out and be a dad to to Georgie, you know? Have him and Maxie co-parent. Leave Spinelli out of the relationship between Nathan and Maxie. Now, to me, I did love Maxie and Spinelli back in the day, but their love fizzled out when, you know, they uh, had Maxi with, um, you know, with um, with um, Patrick Drake's brother, Matt, um, you know, played by the actor who played Sean Douglas Brady on Days of Our Lives years ago. And um, that's just how I feel. But I'm glad that Chris Storm is back and that, you know, she focused on her health first. And, I was, and, and as always, you have to focus on yourself first and your, and your health and make sure you're fine and healthy. And I'm glad she did that. I'm glad she's uh, doing much better from what I read. So, um, you know, hopefully when she comes back, we get to see the old Maxi. We get to see, you know, how Maxi will take in all this information about, you know, in the, uh, encountering, uh, you know, Claudette, um, you know. And, you know, even though my Burnett's going to be playing, um, you know, uh, Maxi, it sounds as if, you know, Molly Burnett's Maxie will be reacting to Brie Williams' Claudette. And to me, I have no problem at all. You know, maybe if they do flashback scenes, we'll get to see Crystal Storm's, um, you know, reaction to uh, Claudette, Claudette as Maxie. So, and as far as uh, Molly Burnett goes, I think she'll do a fine job. But hopefully she has watched clips enough here and there of Maxie to, to get a taste and a feel of what Maxie is all about. But time will cost all guys think about this. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you more neutral about Crystal Storm's back to general hospital? And if so, tell me in the comments down below. 
Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget always to comment on the channel, guys. And until next time, it's Nancy and peace. Take care. I will see you guys there for the next video coming up later on this afternoon, tonight, tomorrow, or in a couple of minutes. So stay tuned. So until next time, take care, guys. I will see you guys later. Peace. Have a good Thursday. Have a good Thursday, guys. Have a good day. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel as always. And until next time, I'm out.